I take two hours to go to my college. Yeah, it's it sucks. Try to get like college is bearable. It's just a phase and it'll end, right? Work, especially if it's very decent, if it's good payment and it's a stable work and you like your job, try to aim for something that's near your house. If not, aim for something further. Get the experience. No less than two years of experience. Apply to other hospitals while you're working. If you get the other dream job, just quit this and start with that. Take no less than two years of experience. In my country, if you have one year of experience, you're no different than an intern that got out of the hospital or got out of whatever job you had and you took six months. When I graduated high school, I was in a really bad place. My high school, my teachers, they laughed at me. They told me I had no future. They told me I should just aim to be a housewife with kids. Them just implying a housewife that takes care of kids is an easy job and a low, no lifer just shows how dumb they are and how much of an idiot my school teachers were. Them telling that to a 16 year old girl in last grade of high school is just so dumb. Thankfully, my parents are really hoggers. They supported me in everything. They knew I had a talent in art. They took me to galleries. They told me to draw. They encouraged me. They bought me tools. Then I was like, I do not want this to be a job. Mom at that time brought a, it was a paper cut from a magazine about some college that opened up admissions for nurse diplomas and stuff. And mom came to me and she was like, Teru, you watch a lot of medical shows. You took care of me when I got third degree burns. Since you were little, you were responsible and the less panicky person when something really big happens at home. I really think you would be great in taking care of people and looking after injured people and stuff. Why don't you try it? Why don't you go there, ask them and see how you feel? Next day, I went to the college, took an interview. I went in, honors degree, graduated became one of the most notable nurses in the hospital I worked in as an intern, then as a normal nurse in another hospital. My school that never believed in me called me and they were like, yo, uh, we have career day and we would love to speak about your career and how proud we are of you and how much uh, of an influence the school was in your life. And I'm like, okay, I'm coming. When is it? I went, basically what I told, they were like middle schoolers. I was like, so yes, I graduated from this school. No one believed in me, not even the teachers. Do not take the teacher's words to heart. Do whatever you think is right for your life. If you think you want to be a scientist, work on it. You will become a scientist. If you have passion to do something and work it through till the finish line, you will do it. Just get off your butt and start working towards your future from now on. My school was really angry. I went out laughing. <laughs> they can heck off. Oh, what influence did your high school give you? Nothing. You guys filled me with rage. The funny thing is they called my mom and they were like, your daughter did this and that. Mom is like, is she a student in your school? Why are you calling me? Why are you guys calling me? Like, can't you guys call her? She's an adult. She's not in your school. If you want to complain about her, go complain to her job. And she hung up. She was like, Taro, they're actually complaining about you. And I'm like, if they want, I can give them my boss's number and my boss will like tell them to heck off as well. The only thing I'm thankful for from my high school is thank you for filling me up with so much rage to the point where my goal was to prove you guys wrong. That's it. That's the only thing, literally. Believe in yourself, whether you're in school, whether you're in college, whether you're in a job you don't like and it's your starting job. Work on yourself. Don't look at people around you unless the comparison is healthy. If you work on yourself and you focus on yourself, you will be so proud of where you stand because you did it by yourself without anyone hand holding you.